Now, I believe it's hard to see them ever doing it in the months ahead. Again, now or never. You know, the power is, is being held by Nancy Pelosi. She gets to make You're the right. call effectively for Democrats You're to right. decide whether this is the path they should take. Oh, uh, well, you know what? There are so many House investigations because the Democrats have the power in the House. The House Judiciary, they issued a subpoena for Hope Hicks and for Annie Donaldson. House Ways and Means, they issued a subpoena for his tax returns. House Oversight Committee seeking documents from his accounting firm. So they're not going to let this end. All right. So Rush Limbaugh put it in perspective like only he can. After this came, comes down at 11, he hops on the air an hour later. Here's a look. A mirage is what the Democrat Party has and the media have been chasing and have been believing in and have been hoping for. And with each mirage and with each belief that you have been saved, you realize you saw something that wasn't there. Well, that's who the Democrats and the media have been. Ever since the Mueller report came out, they had everything wrapped up in it. The Mueller report was going to finally deliver them their reason for living. Bye-bye, Donald Trump. And because Robert Mueller made that mirage come to life, they're going to grow. They're going to get stronger because of Robert Mueller's creation of a real pool of water. Hmm. And he is from here. You know that, uh, you well know, said. Democrats are going to be talking about this uh, for a lot uh, for a lot longer. It's going to be the same thing. Meanwhile, in Canada, the USMCA is going to pass the new NAFTA. That would affect so many people in the Midwest who have been so devastated by these natural disasters. You got an infrastructure plan where you have a president that wants to build and they might he might have about a trillion dollars to do so. We're not going to do that. And we have an immigration system that you needs to be addressed yesterday. Not comprehensive. And I guess we're going to ignore that. What do you think? Do you think that the Democrats should push for impeachment? A lot of Republicans are hoping they do, because if you look at Bill Clinton's numbers from the beginning of that Monica trial to the end of the impeachment, according to Gallup, his approval rating went up seven percentage points. You know, Peter Strzok talked about that insurance policy. I think what Mueller did there is if they go for impeachment is a new insurance policy, right. which is ensuring that President Trump gets elected in 2020. And guess, and guess it's, what? it's a bad political move, but I don't know that they right. can resist it. And guess what's happening when we're talking about this? Robert Mueller does this is the day in which James Comey writes a column editorial talking about investigating the investigators and what a folly it is and how dumb it is. Mm -hmm. uh, and at least for that. a day or two, we're not going to be talking about that. But we are going to be tossing to Jill.